Clearing and resetting your etheric heart wall, a guided visualization from the Intergalactic Alliance of Light Beings, presented by WhatComesNextForYou.com, with Canadian psychic medium, Tracy Mill. Welcome to this guided visualization designed to help you tap into, recalibrate, and transform your etheric heart wall a feature designed to protect your sensitive side that often holds old trauma energies that can impede your full source connections and emotional processing. You may find it beneficial to work through this exercise several times depending on the depth, breadth, and qualities of your personal heart wall energies. Additional information about these heart walls can be found in our most recent video the form and function of your etheric heart walls. I highly recommend watching it if you haven't already. This exercise is a great way to decommission triggers, help heal from grief taken in at any age and stage of development, help refocus worries for the future, help diffuse or dilute old mental tapes that encourage us to give up without even trying, especially when it comes to our ability to make valuable and valued human to human connections. This exercise will help those ready to take some quantum action, creating an opportunity to get really clear on the inside so you can align with and absorb the new light coatings coming to us from source via the rays of the sunlight more easily. To participate in this repatterning exercise, all you need is a sunny day and 5 to 20 minutes of time where you can bask in the sun's rays, be it through a window or outside in nature. Before you begin this exercise, we recommend you choose a crystal whose energies you'd like to work with. Choose something light and bright. If you're not familiar with the healing and spiritual properties of these crystals, here is a quick overview. Clear quartz brings clarity to emotional, mental, spiritual connections and insight. Citrine invigorates processing of emotional, mental, spiritual connections and adds positivity. Rose quartz stimulates heart connections, emotional, mental and spiritual processing with love. Aquamarine transmutes grief, enhances heart-to-heart -heart communication, empowers and stimulates emotional processing. Opalite transforms dark to light, layered clarity, multiple chakra activation, clear knowledge activation. Selenite is a transmuter of negative energies. This is the master cleaner that clears toxic emotions, brings calming and uplifting energies and clarity of mind. Amethyst is good for transfiguration of hidden beliefs, clearing mental tapes, removing negative mental patterns, and enhancing clairvoyance. If you're uncertain about which one to use, just trust your intuition. If you're guided to work with more than one type of crystal, follow that intuition too. Once you have chosen your crystal, if you don't own the one you have chosen, a quick Google search of images should find you some nice examples for your envisioning files. Look for images of these crystals in sunlight if you can, and if you have the crystal of your choice, bring it with you to your sunlit area. If you have the crystal of your choice, hold it up to the sun and take a few moments to study the qualities and facets of the crystal in the sunshine. Absorb what you intuitively feel is the energy exchange needed that is best suited for you. Send this information through your hands into the crystal, which will help you align your energies and give you your desired results. When you're ready, find a comfortable place in some sun where you can sit or stand and stay comfortable and connected with the ground and the sun for at least five minutes. Begin by claiming your body-mind-spirit complex as sacred and yours for your spirit alone. Claim yourself as the architect of your life, past, present, and future. 
Claim yourself as commander of your energies. Then mentally state your intention to reclaim and repurpose the form and function of your etheric heart wall in a way that allows you to keep the lessons and the wisdoms learned and release the pain back to source for clearing and recycling. Connect with your guides and your higher self and send a telepathic message that you are ready to connect with clear, transmute or transform your etheric heart wall energy system. Breathe in and out softly as you create a bubble of protection around your body, spreading it out into your auric field. Then align your physical body so that the sunlight is shining directly on your chest and face. Connect with the sunshine. Let it bathe you in light and warmth. Welcome the sunlight in and invite it to begin activating your still dormant DNA codes. Breathe softly. With your eyes closed, continue to breathe in and out slowly, following your breath into your body, down your throat, and into the air of your lungs. With each breath in, breathe in this light. And with each breath out, breathe out any shadowy pockets of energy you may be carrying from living through a rough day, a rough week, or a rough year, and release this unwanted energy at this time. Pause the video if needed and take your time with this activity. Just continue to breathe in the light and breathe out the shadows. Breathe in and send that light down into your lungs. See this transferred to your heart before moving out to the rest of your body. Do this until you feel you are connected to the sunlight and source. Stop here if you need more time. Breathe in and out. And when you feel ready to move on to the next stage, tap into your heart wall area. What does it look like or feel like? If you are having difficulty finding it, simply recall a time when you felt rejected by those whose approval meant a lot to you. Then pay attention to where those energies arise within your body as these will lead you to your energetic etheric wall around your heart. Ask to be shown your heart wall area connected to this memory. Breathe in and out softly as you examine this space. How do you experience this energy? Can you see it, feel it? Can you describe it in some way? Can you communicate with this area or energy telepathically? If so, ask what function this wall of hurt memory serves for you. Ask what are its benefits and what are its drawbacks. Breathe in and out gently as you allow the response to come naturally. Based on the answers you have received or the insight gathered, ask yourself if this wall is still needed by you to survive this world. If so, how much stays and what can go or be removed? What have you carried around and guarded against for years that you're quite honestly just ready to release completely? See these old wounds begin to light up in spots along your heart wall. These lights or dots represent the energy pockets in need of clearing, then recalibrating with the crystal energies you have chosen to work with today. Next, imagine manifesting a box, vacuum, or trash can for gathering up these lit up dots along your heart wall. See them leaving the wall and moving into the box or vacuum. As each old memory file moves out, see a new ball of light energies expanding and filling in the missing space. If you wish to utilize the crystal you have chosen, 
to substitute the energies, fill in the open holes with the crystal of your choosing. If needed, pause the video here to take your time with this process. You can also utilize your breath. Imagine the sunshine transmuting these old files and creating new structures, creating safety without impediment to your full emotional library. Do this until you feel you have cleared away all unwanted memory files. And when done, clap your hands together or snap your fingers to instantly disappear the energy vacuum box or bin you have been using for collecting old energy. Breathe out deeply and with your next breath in, breathe in the sunshine with the intention of sending it to your heart wall area for clearing. See it travel down into your newly lit up heart wall Feel it become brighter. If you have infused your heart wall with crystal, assign the energy a new task, something as simple as only love and light in, only love and light out. Let everything else bounce away or be transformed into love before entering your newly clean system will do. Keep it simple or as complex as you like. Some folks will want to take down their heart wall completely. To those, we recommend taking a few days to assimilate to your results. For those who wish to create something new, a heart shield can be instantly activated by your consciousness as needed and is an excellent alternative solution. Simply envision a crystal shield in this area one that can move up and down into defense position instantly and one that can repel negatively charged influences as they appear. Remember your envisioning abilities are connected to your higher dimensional equipment. Envisioning manifests results you can feel on all levels. When you're ready, return to your original state of mind. Keep your aura nice and wide and enjoy the new energy flow you have created within yourself today. When you're ready, return to your now. Wiggle your fingers and toes. Place your crystal, if used, in a sunlit window for clearing and reset. Write down your insights while the impressions are still fresh in your mind. However you choose to do it, when you're ready to remove or transform these old defensive response patterns still at play and affecting you now, we recommend working with the sunlight to help the transformation take hold on a cellular level. Don't worry about doing it exactly right or all in one go, as you will be intuitively guided to the option that is best for you. Take your time. This effort may need more than one application depending on your circumstances and heart wall conditions. The rewards you'll receive are subtle but tangible. As once the transmutation is complete, fear of failure, insecurity and self-loathing will have a much harder time gaining a hold within your body-mind-spirit complex, making you much harder to mess with on a quantum level. We thank you for joining us today. Congratulations on your heart wall clearing. This is important work that you are doing. On behalf of the Intergalactic Alliance of Light Beings, I am Chimera. Namaste. If you have enjoyed this video, check out more of our offerings on YouTube or go to whatcomesnextforyou.com to sign up for your own private consultation with Tracy Milne and the Intergalactic Alliance of Light Beings. What comes next for you.com? What's in your future?